Hey guys, what's up? This is Al from GeorgeStark.com with another Android game review for you guys, and this is of Copycat by Imageworks. Now the objective of this game is just like Simon says. The screen will actually flicker and give you a specific sound, note, or color that you have to click, and you're going to have to repeat that. Now as you keep going on, each move keeps getting one step harder. So the first level, it gives you one note to play, you tap one note. Second level gives you two notes to play, you tap two notes, etc, etc. This game is $1.30 from the Android market. Of course, if you don't like it, you can get a refund. So let's go ahead and take a look at the game itself. Alright guys, so as you can see, the icon is actually the actual user interface that's in the game itself, and it says Copycat. So let's go ahead and launch open the game, and here we are. So tapping menu, as you can see, you can have to start a new game. You can go to help, which will show you the game rules and technical support. And then you can tap menu and go to settings and you can turn sound and vibration on and off. Timeout mode, you can change the speed which I'll put on ultra just to show you guys the fastest speed. You can change the button style, I'll just keep it on the classic color so it's easier to play. You can change the tones, I'll put them on piano. The buzzer volume, as you can see I have it on loud. The, I can resume the game and it tells me to prompt or I can clear the stats. So to actually start the game, you just tap the screen. And as you can see it told me to click yellow, so I click yellow. Level 2, yellow, red. Level 3. And this is the extent of the game. That's all there is to the game. You just gotta keep playing and really have a great memory to actually play this game. Oh. <laughs> so that's actually the game here. And as you can see, when you lose, you actually have to start completely over. So now I'm just going to show you guys some gameplay. Oh, fail. So that's actually the game, and as you can see, there's actually some really good settings, like the button style. Go ahead and change it to Midnight Black, jump back, and now it looks more stealth and looks really nice. Uh oh. <laughs> so there you go. And again, there's also another setting that I think a lot of you Android fans will like Android Green. So we'll jump into that, go back, and here we have it. Tap the screen. I don't know why that happened. And that's the game. So, really, really simplistic game that's actually really addicting. Alright guys, so I don't know if you guys like the game, but I think it's really addicting and pretty fun and with different modes that you can actually set the theme, definitely gets it to a little more personal flavor. Now some pros of the game are definitely, again, that it's addicting. If you like that type of game, it's really addicting and it'll get you playing every day. Some cons of the game is that you're really stuck to those sounds. It'd be really cool to add some music in the background or it'd be really cool to actually install some custom skins. Uh, there's not a lot of customization, but they give you customization at all, which is definitely good. And for $1.30, I really think this is one of the best games for the money that's on the Android market. Thanks for watching. This is Al from DroidShark.com, and I'll see you guys in my next video.